and things. And this is just like a regular Everywhere day here in the bullet home. I'm actually sick of all of them. I'm definitely sick of the big black one that's jumping in this thing right here. You all right, boy? You know, look, like I'm yelling at the white kids. You can, you get, that's two years right there. <laughs> the older kids is cool. They're like taking algebra. Yo, what's good, YouTube? Welcome back. Or if it's first time, welcome to Skylar Reacts. Today, today, today is November 1st. And the only thing that's on my mind is Thanksgiving. Like, as soon as October, like, Halloween is over with, it's just Thanksgiving. And, yeah, that being said, I found this video. It's like a little Thanksgiving um skit where it's celebrating Thanksgiving dinner with a white family for the first time. Hope y'all enjoy. As always, leave a like, comment, subscribe, join the fam. And, yeah, let's get it. Right now, we are about to have Thanksgiving dinner with a pure 100% white bread family. Top to bottom, everybody's <laughs> in the house is white. Nobody's a dog. Bro, why he made it sound like they were like dogs or something? Pure 100% white. <laughs> like, the hell? Like, he's talking about a breed of dog or something. With a pure 100% white bread family. Top to bottom, white everybody's bread. in the house is white. Nobody's adopted. This is Bill Bellamy, old house. And the white man bought it because he loved Bill Bellamy's dance moves. This looked like a house Bill Bellamy bought with his uh, How to Be a Player check, but then he, he lost it. <laughs> I'm sure there's some type of hidden tragedy lying in that house. Maybe the omen, or maybe the house is buried on an ancient Indian burial ground. I don't know. This journey, man. We come in peace. We come in peace. Bro, no lie. This is such a fire idea. <laughs> it's just three black kings. Oh, hey. Hey. What's up, buddy? Damn. They have a daycare? How many kids? One, bro. They have what? Nine kids? Eight? Eight kids? What the hell? Hey, Hi, Steve. Seven? I got my boys. This is Slain. Hey, so is this the first time you had cribs in your house? Yeah. yeah. Hey, can I get your <laughs> palm dress? These kids already got cars and they number like 10 years old. I already told homeboy I'm staying in the back for like the next four or five years. Cody. 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 Cozy. 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 You know, you got a two parent home. Yeah. You know, all the kids got the same mama and the same. Nah, they got money, money. What the hell? Cozy. You know, you got a two parent home. Yeah. You know, Bro, they got heaven up on the ceiling. What the, what type of house is this? All the kids got the same mama and the same daddy. What? You know, he look like he want to be here too. Yeah. Are your kids in a musical <laughs> group? You got a bunch of silver shoes on the ground. This is really Never Neverland. When I walked the in, Jackson 10. I saw the shiny shoes they got over there by the staircase. I thought they was in a group, like the Jacksons. He's Tito. Yeah. He's oh, back. that's not good, buddy. Okay, kids, I'm going to, I'm going to the hood. You, you kids, you want to go to the hood? This is over, bro. Come on. <laughs> Bro, you gotta watch what you say to people, kids, bro. You know, ask them if they want to go to the hood. <laughs> bro, you cannot take black people anywhere, bro. I swear. Okay, kids, I'm going to I'm going to the hood. You you kids, you wanna to go to the hood? This is overwhelming. I've seen I've been in a household with a lot of kids before, but not like to where they all are just bowing your face. I've been in a house where like three kids is upstairs and they on PlayStation and just don't even talk to you. They just kind of stare at you. And, but these Thank God, bro. I wish people would like train the kids to have some type of like social awareness. You know what I'm saying? Like keep a distance. Kids like kid people kids be in your face, all on your lap, all wanna be up on you. Like, bro, relax. Relax, bro. <laughs> it's like such an awkward moment. And then you're looking at the parent like, you know, get your child. Like you don't want to say anything, but kind of like, bro, get your child. <laughs> These kids be in your face. Smoke yours. Good old Thanksgiving parade. I don't usually watch the Thanksgiving parade in my own home. Um, my True. mother would generally have it on, but I'm probably outside of enjoying some fine cannabis. The dog show's coming on. Oh, the dog show the dog coming show, on, y'all. So every year we pick out our favorite dog from uh, the, the, and we all pick who we think is gonna win. Y'all be betting money? You know, I'm in the house, I'm, I'm gonna watch whatever they put on. You know, I'm not gonna... Bro, who sits down and watch the dog show on Thanksgiving? I can understand maybe like the parade and whatnot. Even on the parade, I think it been slacking because I kind of watched the parade last year and it was like, what is this? But the parade is one thing, but the dog show, they better be putting money on, let's make it some what exciting, like, all right, let's put some money on it, like, you know what I'm saying? Y'all be betting money? You know, I'm in the house, I'm, I'm gonna watch whatever they put on, you know, because I'm not gonna try to disrespect them. And I don't want them to call the cops on me so they can put a dog show on. So y'all really watch dogs on TV? 
Yeah. Like really? Steven, you co you 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 co-sign this? What's his name? Bullock on TV? Yeah. Like really? Bullock. Really? Steven, you co you 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 co-sign this? White people really watch dogs on TV. Like you wanna see dogs, just go outside, look at some dogs in the hood. You see all kinds of dogs. Ugly dogs, mangy dogs. What's wrong with that dog? <laughs> That's a sad dog, he got no eyes. They got a dog inside with one eye. The damn dog look like Fetty Wap. Mama probably like Fetty Nah, he crazy. Nah, this <laughs> Did he just see the dog look like Fetty Wap because it has one eye? Nah. <laughs> they got a dog inside with one eye. The damn dog look like Fetty Wap. Mama probably like Fetty Wap. She probably saw the video, got a little crush on him. At my house on Thanksgiving, <laughs> you got your auntie and them. Mm -hmm. You got your uncle and them, and they all, they just, they pull rank over the TV anyway. If I turn to the dog show, I might get my hand cut off. Is it, is this Especially the uncles? I don't think so. I got a dog in the fight, not to be funny, the terrier. The boss and terrier, I'm putting my money on that. How you making Thanksgiving turkey, baby? Well, it's pretty simple. I just take some butter. Baby? Nah, if I'm the husband, bro, I'm crashing up, bro. I don't care what color you are, bro. Calling my wife baby is crazy. <laughs> But wait, what the hell is she doing? That's a real turkey? Why it look like that? How you make your Thanksgiving turkey, baby? Well, it's pretty simple. I just take some butter, mm -hmm. and I butter the whole outside so it doesn't get dry when okay. I put it in the oven. Mm. What do you see that? You gonna put no seasoning on it? Uh, yeah, around I'm... the corner, right by the oven. So right now I'm in the kitchen, and I can already see there's some real cultural differences happening right now. <laughs> I've never used things like rosemary. I they're all full. No, don't tell me she have a cabinet full of spices that's unopened. Real cultural differences happening right now. I've Bro, they're all full. Literally every single one of them is not open. Maybe, well, maybe this one is kind of like halfway, but what the hell? Never use things like rosemary. I, I didn't even like know you pepper. could buy ground mustard. Yeah. Your kids don't like pepper. No. You give your children a choice. And the mashed potatoes came out of a box. It was called Idaho Spuds. It's like a box of cocaine. That's crazy. I didn't know what was going on. I was like, why are you cooking your mashed potatoes out of a box? What's wrong with the turkey skin? I don't know. I think because it was cold. Where would you get this turkey at the swimming pool? Turkey skin look like Puff Daddy kneecaps. I'm anticipating not eating the plate of it. That's what I'm anticipating. How they bake ham? Talk to me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it's already prepped and you stick it in the oven. How much are these? A lot. What's a lot? A hundred bucks. A hundred dollars! For some ham? A hundred, nah, they got money. Bro, you spend a hundred dollars on just ham for Thanksgiving and you got eight kids? No, you got money. Oh, a ham. Wait, for a ham. For a ham? For a ham? She for a ham. Plate down, I'm gonna look at it, I'm gonna look at her and nod. And I'm just gonna she to go down to a fucking family dollar or something. Not even Publix had got them for a hundred dollars. What the hell? Look at the plate. And watch the kids run around. I'm gonna look at it. I'm gonna look at her and nod. And I'm just gonna look at the plate. And watch the kids run around the table because that's what's gonna happen. Steve got so many kids. I just did a I just did a blood test. Steve might be my damn daddy. I got a handful of stuff going on in this house right here, man. Hey, what's up, Austin? I was just gonna show your sister how to flip a bird. Right now we just play them, man. They just they this is what they do. This is every day for them. They just got space. They don't even got they don't gotta walk to the park. This is the park. <laughs> Straight A's across the board for everybody. Yeah. I would never look at my report card. Something about this video is also like so wholesome too. Okay, just show like two different cultures just coming together and they're showing like the differences, but it also like respect each other and whatnot. Even though it's supposed to be like a comedy skit, I can see like it's like it's kind of like a comedy skit, but it's actually like real, real. You feel me? Like I could tell like they're not acting whatsoever. See straight A's. It'd be like B. B, C, D, talks too much, talks too much. When I was coming up as a child, we did a lot of the same stuff. We didn't have all this good stuff like they got, but yeah, the kids went outside and played while the adults stayed inside and got high. Bro, the, bro, the kids have their own community outside. They got their own house, their car, they got their playground, they have a, a garage. It's good stuff like they got, but yeah, the kids went outside and played while the adults stayed inside and got hell? high. Just go get you nine ounces, go straight to St. Louis with it. You know what I'm saying? Get your bread. I think Al Sharpton and uh, the Black Lives Matter uh, is gonna have Slink go to all the white neighborhoods and just take their kids away till we get our freedom. I don't know how we connect <laughs> it. What type of music y'all listen to? If the homies can't have none. Y'all don't know that song? 
That's a classic. We just basically showing them what it is, like just merging cultures. Look at this. Facts. You got like this at home, you got a real shot at life, man. They say they really wear this stuff every day. Peep the like, outfit. They really dress like full house every day. Like everybody's <laughs> on match. He said it dressed like full house every day. No lie, bro. I have a different respect for people who actually get dress up, dress up, just to sit at home all day long and don't go anywhere. Like, yeah, you you bored, bro. Things, and this is just like a regular Everywhere day here in the Bullet Home. I'm actually sick of all of them. I'm definitely sick of the big black one that's jumping in this thing right here. You all right, boy? You know, well, look, I'm yelling at the white kids. You can, you get, that's two years right there. <laughs> the, the older kids is cool. They're like taking algebra. He said, look at him yelling at the white kids. That's two years right there. <laughs> oh stuff my God, grade. bro. Like, I, I didn't yeah. jump in this thing right here. You all right, boy? You know, well, look, I'm yelling at the white kids. You can, you get, that's two years right there. So the older kids is cool. They're like taking algebra and stuff in eighth grade. Like, I, I didn't do that to like my senior year in high school. So they're really smart. One girl's gonna help me with my taxes. And I'll tell you what, you look at my taxes, I'll get you your I'll own outfit. So y'all don't have to dress the same all the time. I guarantee you, each one of them have a credit score at least 750 minimum. I'm gonna get, I'm Every gonna single kid. Unique, okay? <laughs> Even the baby, the toddler, all of them. If I had a better vision <laughs> for this house, it'd be hella hoes back here, like a dolphin jumping out the pool, like just, you know, Hennessy bottles everywhere. But this, because this is a family environment, this really got me thinking about, you know, oh my going God. half on a baby. I'm about to go to the kitchen, man. It's so lovely talking to y'all. Look up, Nate Dog. All right, pimps, the moment of the truth has finally arrived. The house is smelling splendid, and we about to pull this bird out the hot box and see what it do. Definitely gonna throw some hot sauce on top of my sure. beans. Happy Thanksgiving! Turn up! Let's turn, turn up, up one time. Turn back. There we go. Make some room for that bird. Ooh, that bird. Look it, had, it had cocoa butter lotion. The turkey, the ham going on. Clean silverware. Sometimes my mama don't clean the silverware that good because she lazy. Take my hell. Yeah. You have like the um old food stain and whatnot, little watermarks on the on the silverware. Oh. Off the table right now. Show his lineup off. Usually my family does a lot of arguing at Thanksgiving. You know, it was just all harmony here. I want to thank the books personally for letting us in their house. It's been a beautiful. I I haven't been nervous this whole time. It almost reminds me of like you know early like colonial type stuff. The way they they just invite us into their house. Real <laughs> nice. <laughs> you said early colonial. <laughs> I'm really thankful that we've had this opportunity to host you guys oh here. It's God. been, you, been totally, you, totally a blast. Oh, mommy, welcome, mom. I'm, I'm eating my plate. I don't know what Slink and Mo doing. They just took it upon themselves to start feeding other people. And that's just, oh, yeah, trust me. Yeah, we know you're going to eat your plate. Yeah. We I don't know, know what Slink and Mo doing. They just took it upon themselves to start feeding other people. And that's just not how we get down in my house. You know what I'm saying? Every man for himself. Facts. So now that you've seen our Thanksgiving traditions, are you going to be watching the Macy's Parade and the National Dog Show every year? Absolutely. Since we came over here and enjoyed this, you know, enjoyed your traditional Thanksgiving dinner, next Thanksgiving you have to do something. Are you going to invite us to your house? I can do that, but I want at your house, I want you to serve Kool-Aid. I was just looking at these kids. I was thinking, man, these kids really... Hey, cool, bro, you cannot go wrong with a nice cool glass of some Kool-Aid, bro. Oh my God, that shit just hit different. They really need just one more glass full of sugar. My overall experience having them here was really awesome. They're really awesome people and I just, they were a lot of fun. I got a little situation going on with Santa Monica Court. Could you come down and talk on my behalf? <laughs> you know, I am a lawyer. <laughs> kids love them and they're so funny. Come on, I get nervous when white kids crying around me. Don't do that. Oh, awesome. Awesome. Do you want to go come back and So I hope they come every year. There's a lot of love going on in this house. There's not a lot of beltage though. You know what I'm saying? Get some beltage popping. A little corporal punishment sometimes, you know what I'm saying? How I Did he just say some beltage? Bro, the kids will be in the entire time. What you mean? <laughs> I would rate my overall experience at a white Thanksgiving. I'd give it 10 stars. You never watched B&T? Mm -hmm. no. What? You Are you surprised? <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna get a people of 10. I'm gonna get a food of zero. If I go lower than a zero, I could. Like a negative Damn. zero. You know, this kid is eating my whole plate, so. <laughs> I'm gonna let him do what he has to do. I gave him the fork. I, don't do that. I will rate my overall experience of the white Thanksgiving dinner six out of ten, seven out of ten, only because they didn't give me nothing to go home with. Like they didn't. Did he? Is he hot boxing the kids? Oh, this. Give me no money. I know he did not hot box the kids 
what is it play playhouse whatever and still give them a six or a seven that's insane seven out of ten only because they didn't give me nothing to go home with like they didn't give me no money or no parting gifts oh. or nothing like a watch or you know expensive camera. I mean, it was I, I've had an excellent time over here. I couldn't tell you no different. You know what I'm saying. Not gonna lie, this was a real wholesome video, bro. Not gonna lie. I'm Boo Johnson. I'm Teddy. But let me know in the comments what y'all think. Like, comment, subscribe, join the fam, and I'll see y'all for the next one.